this year Just want to let down my head Don't want to forget but remember all right, guys, I'm glad that you're back. The under-16 division took to the football field at 2 p.m. Let us go to Kuva at the Atto Bolden Stadium where W Connection took on Club Sando. Then we're going to go to Frederick Settlement Grounds to have a look at the Defence Force versus Police FC under-16 match. So we're underway here. Under 16 action between W Connection and Club Sando. Cross coming in. Good looking cross. Head go up. It's in. First blood W Connection. It looked a good cross going in. Getting on it was the number nine, heading it into the corner. Ambitious hit. Goalkeeper well behind it. Comfortable dealing. Oh, he gave up on it. They're not really able to connect something going forward. Not much players going forward. Players slipping around on this ball. Oh, very good ball. He can get it before the keeper. Yes, he can. There should be a chance. One all. Club Sando have equalized. Turning nicely. He has a couple defenders for company. Looking for some support. Skips past a couple. Should get a free kick. Sorry, a, a goal kick. Sorry, is the call. As connection passed the ball around in the back. We've seen some calamitous moments from goalkeepers for the day. Chance. Can he get a shot off? Goal! Menes Jara, goal number two. The defense is on top of this one. Very good pass. A lot of pulling happening and the assistant referee flagging for it. They're actually a, a good turnout here at the Otto Boland Stadium. Teammates, family members, parents alike. Falls invitingly. He would definitely want to have that chance again. What a good pass. And they have numbers on that side of the field. Very good pass. Turns this man nicely. Jara. Definitely the best player on the field thus far.
Jabari going for sh for goal. Thunderous effort. The wall coming in the way. Good ball for the substitute, but he was standing in an offside position. So we've come to the end of the first half of football here. It is Club Sandu who are in the lead by two goals to one over W Connection. Menace Jara has been the main poacher up front for Club Sandu. His workmanship has really put him to the forefront. One two connection. Oh, no one there actually, yes. Maureen giving up possession to Dugan. Just stepping over the ball. Chance! And doubly connection creating the first chance of the second half. Maybe you want to get a bonk or skip off the tooth before getting to the goalkeeper. Little Luke Savory. Savory, oh! The goalkeeper will get on top of this one. Carby getting forward. Carby, can, can he put this one in? Good save! And it's a goal! All square here. W connection. They've really entered. It's Dugan. Shot at goal. Goalkeeper spills. But he handles. It's floating nicely. Heads go up. A hash of a clearance. Put Club Sander back under pressure with Manswell. Clipping over. The goalkeeper has this calmly. Rashad Hart. Definitely have to be an all out attack method here. And it's all over between Club Sando and W Connection, the score, two all. Randolph Boyce is the name, W Connection FC. This is my third year with them. So far everything going good so far. Oh, usually they are practice. We have a lot of turnout. We have about almost 28 people. We get that number almost every training session. The guys are very interested in the game. They want to learn the football and play the football in the right way. We encourage them and motivate them highly so they really come out and they give the best. You know, it's only unfortunate that all of them cannot play on the same day with the hard work that they put in. Um, we have a quite few standout, like um, Jace Dugan. We have um, Manswell, the other striker. We have Medford in the midfield. We have oh, our, our whole back line, <laughs> pretty good. Our keeper, outstanding. Um, the reason being is that the hard work and the effort that they put into the training and then the philosophies of the game, we try to teach them all the philosophies, you know, the, by seeing, by doing, by learning, plenty tactical works, blackboard works, plenty on the field, off the ball, session with the ball. So we try to really get the game across to them the way that we feel at connection that it should be learned. Uh, when we play our philosophy and style is to keep the ball and move it around as much as possible. Uh, today was a real intense game today. They really, the team, they bring it to us in terms of intensity. You know, um, the guys, they respond well and we came from behind so they show a lot of character and deserving to get that point 
but it had times that they had the opportunities that they could have take the chances and see the game home for us. But unfortunately, it didn't happen today. I am the Nielsen Dogan. I am 15 years of age and I represent Dobby Connection. Um, well, we trained very hard. Um, we didn't execute everything, but we played to our best ability at the, at the time. Um, we could... Well, training was very hard. And thanks to the coaches that we learned something and we, next game we will try to do our best to execute it. Well, in training, we um, practiced a lot on the one-twos and the defending in the attack um, and knocking going forward and thing. Um, um, well, fellas, I could have say, go to school, get your education. If you choose on taking football, take it very seriously. Um, hopefully, they can come to the club and train all the best to make it as a professional footballer.